Well, taking a live look outside right now on this warm and breezy Wednesday. And it looks like we can expect more of the same tomorrow. Meteorologist Albert Ramon is here now with your first alert weather. Albert? Uh, Jim and Dana, yes, just as windy tomorrow. These strong westerly winds gusting now around 30 miles per hour. We're expecting much of the same tonight and through the day tomorrow. We're going to crank up the heat, though, starting tomorrow a bit. Right now, low to mid 80s on the map. Anywhere from 80 degrees in DeKalb to 86 at the loop. It's 85 at both Waukegan and Valley. Paraiso, and right now we're looking at wind gusts across Cook County around the 30 mile per hour mark out of the due west and the winds again stay breezy to windy here as we roll through this evening. Right now we have these fair weather cumulus clouds. Those are created with daytime heating. So after sunset will be mostly clear at 10 o'clock with temperatures in the 70s out in the western suburbs, but low 80s across Cook County. And then as we head towards tomorrow morning, a few clouds in the sky temperatures tomorrow morning in the 60s out towards the west, but 70s right along the lake shore. So it's a breezy and warm night ahead. And then here's a look at tomorrow afternoon. We're looking at a mostly sunny sky, wind gusts around 30 miles per hour, and upper 80s and low 90s will be on the map for tomorrow afternoon. There will be enough heating and just enough instability to generate a few spotty showers late in the day for tomorrow. One of the new high resolution forecast models showing right before sunset, a couple of showers will be possible, but we'll put the rain chance tomorrow. It'll be small at 10%. For Friday, partly cloudy and 91, not as breezy and then an unsettled weather pattern late Friday night. We think after midnight into the early morning hours on Saturday for a chance of showers and thunderstorms. Here's how it works out with our hourly forecast. Much here Friday on the dry side. A few showers and thunderstorms late Friday night to early Saturday morning. Dry for much of Saturday afternoon and then another opportunity for some showers and thunderstorms Saturday night into Sunday. So several hours of dry weather expected this weekend, but there could still be a few spots that see as much as an inch of rainfall just Saturday and Sunday if we add up those two days. Some cooler air though arrives for the second half of the weekend. We'll look for a chance of rain on Sunday at 40%, the high temperature at 82, and temperatures will be a bit cooler than where they have been, low 80s for much of next work week. Dana and Jim. Albert, thank you.